uh, and we had Kyiv office. So thanks to our CEO, we started uh, planning and preparation uh, two months before the war started to ensure security. There's, the world is truly changing underneath our feet. Changing the world, one blockchain at a time, with George Levy. Brought to you by Blockchain Institute of Technology. Hi, and welcome to Changing the World, One Blockchain at a Time, where we feature the leading minds and personalities in blockchain, Bitcoin, and cryptocurrency. Today's guest is Maria Ozadowska. Maria is the Acting Chief Operating Officer, as well as the Director of Marketing and Communications at Solve.care. Maria brings a decade of business and marketing experience, and she's a proven leader who has delivered significant business and brand growth within the insurance and healthcare tech sectors. Maria, I'm so very excited to speak to you today. Thank you for being in the show. Thank you, George, for having me. It is a great pleasure and honor to be with you, your uh, viewers, and uh, Blockchain in uh, Institute of Technology. That's wonderful to have you. I'm actually really excited about our conversation today. Um, Actually, I'd like to ask you a few questions, and uh, please feel free to respond how you wish, but I actually really want to get into your mind because there are not many female executives in the blockchain industry, and as somebody, I do a lot of interviews, so being able to speak with you and, uh, and acknowledging that you're a female in such a, a high power position is really exciting for me. So uh, I'd like to get this opportunity to just have you tell me a little bit about yourself, your journey to where you are today, and more or less, in, in the roles where you're at, what's the day-to-day -day of being Maria Ozodowska? So let's split this question to two parts. Um, let's talk about my journey a little bit, and after that, um, how to be a woman um, in the executive position in blockchain. So I uh, came to blockchain uh, space from insurance. I was working in a global um, insurance company, and I was responsible for public relations and top 50 global brand. And uh, after that, my journey in blockchain started uh, at SolveCare. I learned a lot here about blockchain technology and which impact blockchain can have on lives of real of people, uh, if it is applied properly, of course. Uh, so um, I think that it is a great privilege for all of us to be a part of this blockchain community because basically this is like to be a, in a group of mavericks who are trying to lead society to some new era of innovation. Um, and the end result of this innovation is that average person will get some benefits out of it. So... No, you were saying, because I actually, I love the vision of where you're going, because a lot of people, when they think blockchain, automatically they think about cryptocurrencies, but that's not where you are. And, uh, and that's why I'm excited about this conversation. Please continue on your path. Exactly, 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 George. So um, when um, I came to SolveCare, our CEO told me that uh, at SolveCare, you will, in a year, actually learn uh, what you will learn in uh, any other business uh, within five years. Uh, actually, back then, I didn't understand that uh, he actually means that I will work three times harder. Uh, <laughs> but um, overall, self-care became a part of my life mission, I would say. And um, I started in marketing, and uh, with our outstanding marketing team, we achieved a lot. We built together global brand, global community, and not only community of um, global blockchain enthusiasts, but also we have global community of physicians. These are top-notch physicians, innovators, award-winning physicians who are helping to shape us our platform, healthcare platform. So um, also we received a lot of recognition together with them around the world. We have been recognized as top blockchain company for healthcare in many countries. And, um, but the most, I'm most proud of when our clients actually get rewards when, for implementation of a software platform. And it happened uh, with one of our clients, Arizona Care Network in 2019, and they were recognized uh, as the most innovative accountable care organization in the US for implementation of SolveCare platform and our solution, which we built for them. So it was a very interesting journey in marketing and we keep going. Um, some parts uh, I was responsible for recruitment, development. In development, we delivered to the market a very complex network for a very big healthcare company, healthcare client. Uh, after that, 
I think that the most challenging times uh, were in my positions of chief of staff and uh, acting COO, because we went as business through major disruption, uh, which was brought by COVID, and after that, mm. war in Ukraine. And um, I think that when such things happen in 21st century as war, um, you actually reevaluate a lot. Uh, what has happened and what value what value the most and i think that back then i strengthened my belief that the core of any successful business is their team and um, i'm very grateful and will always be very grateful to our team uh, we have team in 11 countries and uh, we also had uh, a team uh, in uh, Kiev, uh, and we had Kiev office. So thanks to our CEO, we started uh, planning and preparation uh, two months before the war started to ensure security of um, everyone and business continuity. But when war started, our t global team actually picked up a lot and uh, they, uh, our guys in Malaysia, US, Canada, Pakistan, India, they just asked if we can take more responsibilities and uh, if we can help uh, with anything we can to ensure that team in Ukraine can focus on the relocation and uh, secure uh, families. So all of you are safe. Uh, back then, I think that it changed, changed a lot in my um, also understanding and perception. And uh, right now, my focus as um, COO is to ensure that not only we have business continued, not only that we have all processes, operations in place, but also that um, we keep developing this outstanding team who are ready to have backs of each other as we do now and uh, who will um, fight for each other and for the company. Because uh, when you are in the company that disrupts trillion dollar business, uh, you need to have a team of A players. And okay. so... No, please, it's, it's just amazing as a leader, you're not, not just guiding forward the vision, but guiding forward the vision with so many challenges simultaneously. This is a moment in time. This is literally, this, this show is called Changing the World One Blockchain at a Time, but there's, the world is truly changing underneath our feet and there's so many challenges you're facing and yet you're guiding the company forward. Please continue because I mean, I was like, wow, you're really handling all this and your, your team is growing. You're still strengthening the company and as I, as a, as a leader, I truly, truly commend you for that. Thank you, George. Uh, we can do so far. It, uh, everything, uh, it, everything is achievable when you have a strong team around you. So I can only be thankful to all of them. And um, uh, when uh, we um, actually, when war started, uh, because we received so much support from our global team, we were able to help others. And uh, we as a company uh, worked with uh, mayors uh, in western part of Ukraine, and we set up 10 care shelters, and we helped more than 2,000 people who lost their homes and uh, everything in a minute uh, so they could stay and they can have some safe place where they could uh, stay with their kids and uh, families. Uh, so this is one part of a journey. Uh, second, uh, how to be um, an ex in the executive position in blockchain industry. Overall, I'm Ukrainian. And uh, in Ukraine, uh, our culture, we treat women with uh, great respect. And uh, I think that I'm pretty lucky, was and am, uh, because I was always um, led by an outstanding CEOs and vice presidents in any business I worked. And um, I, I have never felt uh, actual difference. Uh, what is uh, to be a woman uh, or a man in business? Uh, and um, blockchain industry itself, I think that this is uh, an industry of uh, friends. At least this is how I feel about it, uh, starting from 2017 and till now. Um, everyone supports each other. Uh, we are all like one family uh, who is uh, united around one mission to bring blockchain to the mass adoption. Uh, so this is um, where we are right now. And I think that what I want, message I want to deliver to your viewers who are young men and women, um, don't be afraid, just think big and um, be ready to work really hard to achieve your goals because this is what it takes. 
<laughs> wow, I, I don't even know where to go from there because that's exactly the vision. We truly are changing the world and the way you bring it. It really is a matter of belief and, and I'm so very glad to be part of this community with you. So glad you're here. Uh, so let me let me go back into solve care. So I keep saying solve.care. Um, it, it, can I say both solve.care or solve care? Yes. I'm allowed in both. Yes. Got yeah. it. Mm -hmm. So I, I want to know more about solve.care. Specifically, like what does solve.care intend to achieve? Because you're taking on you're taking on the healthcare industry, and then solve.care comes in like a like in the blockchain space, which has the potential to disrupt so many things. So can you tell me more about the mission and what solve.care does? Sure, George. So we have a very bold mission. And uh, yes, we are addressing healthcare in uh, all its entirety. And um, our main goal is uh, to decentralize. SolveCare is a healthcare blockchain platform company, and uh, our goal is to decentralize healthcare. We are given full ownership over healthcare data to the patient, where this uh, ownership actually should be. And our one more goal is to ensure that business, all healthcare stakeholders, government, they have proper tools which they can use to build very fast and easy decentralized applications. And this is what they can do on our platform. Our platform is um, basically a vision of uh, our CEO, Pradeep Goyal, and he spent 30 years in healthcare IT. He was in different positions. He um, was working and uh, he launched very complex solutions as Medicare and, and Medicaid, which are being used by millions of uh, users still now. And um, when blockchain has appeared, he saw a great potential in uh, it as in a technology. So um, solve care is basically his life mission and ours well now. And um, we are not smart enough to um, address all problems in healthcare. Our focus is on three main pillars, administration, mm -hmm. coordination, and payments in healthcare. But we are building around our platform a very big ecosystem of our partners, clients, governments in many countries around the world who are smart enough to uh, develop networks which they want. And uh, we call them care networks, but basically this is decentralized applications which we are building on top of our platform. And after that, launch them very fast to the market. So we have invested five years of R&D into the platform. And uh, right now we are basically, we can say that we have achieved uh, what Pradeep has envisioned. And um, right now we are actually, we are at the breakthrough in Web 3.0. And why I'm saying this, because our platform has multiple layers. We have decentralized applications layer. We have a network layer, we have a presentation layer. So basically, our components of the platform are on each of these layers. Mm -hmm. That's why there is nothing like that in the market. We, are, we have this unique platform. And I think that thanks to this platform, we are becoming this bridge between two industries, between conservative healthcare, who is looking for the ways how they can actually adopt the blockchain. And on the other hand, we have blockchain and crypto industry who are trying to get real adoption. Mm -hmm. So this is um, where we are. Our main focus is to ensure that business has the tool and that user, patient, physician, they are in control, in full control of their data. That's actually very, very, very valuable, specifically when we're talking about the concept of decentralization and all the move towards Web3 and like their centralization versus decentralization. And I can totally see how the healthcare industry is as centralized as it can be. So I can see also where the pushback and a lot of the challenge between centralization and decentralization just meeting, right? So it is truly an amazing mission and uh, I wish you the absolute best. Let me ask you a question just so we can actually really, really bring home if there were three things, if you actually had to say just three key things you wanted to say about solve care that people could take away with them, right, to the audience, three things you would want people to know about solve.care, could you share those with me? Absolutely. So first, each um, new technology 
like we had in the era of uh, internet, after all the hype uh, stops, I think it leaves a couple of um, really great outstanding companies which are changing industries using this technology. Mm -hmm. I haven't been in the blockchain industry for a while uh, and soft care, of course. I see great potential for soft care to become such kind of a company that will change healthcare industry globally because we have um, a really great outstanding innovation. We use technology, blockchain technology, but we use it with all our knowledge from healthcare, which Pradeep brought from healthcare and uh, for the benefit of the end user, for the patient. Second thing, Solvecare platform is designed according to Predip's vision. And again, this is uh, 30 years of experience and building and introducing to the market very complex healthcare systems. As one of our developers told me once that, uh, recently actually, that um, Solvecare very soon will become a dream place uh, to work for any top-notch developer around the world. Such a huge innovation will bring to the market and tech stack. So, and third thing is that uh, for all of that, we use um, our native token, Solve token, and Solve token, each transaction which is happening on SolveCare platform uh, is in Solve token, all the payments which are happening in all networks which have been built and will be built are happening in Solve token. What is the unique um, uniqueness of Solve token is that in the network it ha it can have both it can be a stable coin and it can have a variable um, value. So this is what actually impresses um, our physicians with whom we work around the world and uh, overall business. Because this is the main question which business keeps asking us. All right, what is the difference? Because all of them are looking at uh, crypto market and they see. But what we are trying to say to them is that um, these are totally different markets. And uh, you can use technology and you can implement technology for the benefit of business and for, for the benefit of users. It is not about Bitcoin only. And that makes perfect sense to me. It's actually your, your token specifically addresses your needs in the healthcare industry. It's not just some random, it's like not to knock Bitcoin, but Bitcoin has nothing to do with healthcare. Your token addresses specifically the needs you've identified. What a beautiful vision. What a powerful vision. And uh, thank you so much for sharing all this information. I really would like to give the audience the opportunity to actually learn more about Solve.Care, follow you, learn more about what you're doing. Could you please uh, let us know how they can find out more about you? Of course. We'll be happy to. So uh, please go to our website, solve.care. And uh, also we have um, uh, amazing um, community admins uh, on Telegram who will also tell you a lot and answer to all of your questions. So also follow our Telegram channel, solve.care. Thank you so very much, Maria. I truly appreciate the opportunity to be able to speak with you. I wish you and the entire Solve Care the greatest success and please keep on on your incredible mission. George, it was a great pleasure for me. Thank you very much for the invitation. And um, let's change this industry together. I hope you enjoyed this video and that you learned something in the process. I bring you brand new videos every single week. So make sure to subscribe to this channel. And if you have any questions or comments, please leave them below. I would love to hear from you. Until next time, I'm George Levy. We're changing the world one blockchain at a time. See you next time.